What's up guys, it's Wanjay Sneakers here and I'm back with a new review for you guys. It's an early look at the highly anticipated model, the Nike React Element 87. And this is the black colorway. And let's take a look at the box. On the front label you're going to see I went true to size on this, size 9 men's. And it says the Nike React Element 87. Let's get this box out of the way and look at the shoes. If you guys are interested in seeing how these look on feet with different types of socks, I'm going to go ahead and send a link up at the top of the screen. Let's take a look at the shoe. You're going to notice on top there is that see-through material that many people are hyped for. And then if we're taking a look at the bottom, it does have a full React midsole. This is one of Nike's newer cushioning technologies that they've been using in their new shoes, and it's super comfortable. On top, we do have an asymmetric tongue. You're going to see the Nike pinwheel logo right there on the left side. And then when we're turning the shoe around to look at the eyelets, there are hits of suede on a couple of the eyelets. And then on the toe, there is leather. And then back on the heel, there is more leather. And then the Nike React branding right at the top. On the bottom side, you're going to see that there is rubber on the heel and the forefoot. It has rubber nubs on both sides. And then in the center, there is the Nike React branding to show the cushioning, super soft. And then flipping the shoe back around, on the back side we have a Nike heel tab and it has another hit of suede on it. A nice detail on the shoe is that it does have rubber nubs around the toes and I like them because they're kind of a bumper so that I don't hit the React material on anything surrounding me. And then if we take a look at the back portion, you can see there is already creasing on the shoe. It's not a big bother to me, but for some people it might be a bit of a problem. I'm going to turn the shoe around and we'll take a look at the top part. You can see that the tongue is see-through as well. And then there is also a suede hit right here that holds the laces down onto the tongue. Flipping the shoe to the side, there is the Nike logo that runs from the midfoot all the way back to the heel and it connects to a fuse rand of silver material there. And on the back we have a Nike React branded heel cup that is there to help you stay on the footbed itself. On the inside they do use a cork insole for the Nike React. On the underside you can see it is removable and it has the sizing tag on the bottom. Again, if you guys are interested in seeing what these look like on feet with different socks, I'm gonna go ahead and leave the link up in the top corner for you guys to click on. And then another thing I forgot to mention is that the laces are flat laces. So I'm going to leave you guys with this on feed section. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and comment down below what you think about the shoe. This is Wanjay Sneakers. Peace.